hello friends welcome back to the channel today's video as you see from the title is going to be a decorate with me and i also have a small hobby lobby haul so please make sure you stay to the end i will be decorating my breakfast nook for fall hope you guys enjoyed the video if you do hit that subscribe button and once you hit the subscribe button hit the notification button so you won't miss any of my uploads if you are new to the channel hi and welcome my name is Sharetta I do so many different types of content on this channel and if you enjoy the content I would love so very much if you hit that subscribe button and the notification button so you won't miss any uploads to become a part of our YouTube family. I also want to say I love and appreciate you guys so very much. I'm starting this video off with doing a light cleaning in this area and then we're going to jump into decorating. These are some decorative napkins that I got from, I think it was Home Goods, and I thought they were so cute, guys. They have the little pumpkin detail in the corner of the napkins, but I'm not going to use them for napkins. I'm going to fold them the size of a placemat and use them for placemats. always like to share with you guys how I do my place setting in detail so that's what I'm doing in the next couple of clips now to create my centerpiece I'm using items that I already had in my home. The only new items might be some of the fall picks that I use to make my arrangements. So this is the completed look and I love how everything came out. I especially love my centerpiece. Like I stated earlier, I used items that I already had in my home. Some of the picks are new. And when you are creating designs in your home, always shop your home first. Even before you go shopping, check out what you already have at home. You don't always have to go out and buy new decor to create a look. I am going to give you guys an overview of the total look like I said I love how everything came out and the napkins went really well with this design and 
like I said, they are napkins, but I'm using them as placemats. I just folded the ends in a little bit, you know, the size of a regular placemat, and I think they came out nice. So I'm gonna give you guys an overview. I hope you have enjoyed this video thus far. Please stay to the end because I do have a small haul for you guys from Hobby Lobby. So this is the other side of the centerpiece. And on this side, I just placed this um, decorative acorn that I got from Hobby Lobby. And it goes perfectly with this decor for this fall tablescape. enjoyed the video thus far I have a small haul for you guys and I have been including little miniature hauls or small hauls in my videos these are items that I have been picking up you know as I go and I want to share with you guys because I will be using them in upcoming projects so I decided to include these small hauls in with my regular um, video. I hope you guys enjoy this part of the video. If you do, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below which have been your favorite items, which stores you have been shopping at. So now let me share with you guys um, what I got from Hobby Lobby. Most of the items are just florals. Um, I did have a lot of florals, as you saw from my unboxing of my fall decor and if you guys have not seen that video i will link it for you in the description box and make sure you always check the description box of my videos because i link other videos there too and sometimes i will also link them in the cards but i didn't have any florals for this color scheme that i'm going with this year because I'm going with a neutral color scheme. So I had to get some, you know, neutral florals. Most of my florals were just the traditional colors like burnt oranges, golds, you know, deep colors like that. So I had to get some lighter colors um, like beiges and browns and stuff like that. So I'm gonna quickly share with you guys what I got from Hobby Lobby. And I'm gonna start off with this bag here. These are some florals that I got. And I got two of them, two stems. They were $7.99. Really nice. When I have when I buy florals like this, I usually make an arrangement and put them on either side of the arrangement or just inside of the arrangement. But I love decorating with this type of florals. And I'm not too too sure of the name of this floral, but I got two of these. And then I got two of these. 
hope you guys can see because they are kind of tall. This type of floral would be perfect in a floor vase. So these were $11.99 and I got two. And you know, of course, their florals right now are 40% off. Really pretty. This arrangement right here um, was just their regular floral and their regular floral is 50% um, off. So I already have a arrangement like this, but I wanted to get another one. And I have used it so many times in different arrangement guys, and I just love it. It was um, $9.99. And of course you get 50% off. So pretty, love it. I love the detail of it, the colors. I just thought this arrangement was so pretty. Like I said, I already had one. I definitely had to get another one. I already shared this pick with you guys. It was $3.99 and I got some um, a, a week or two ago and I shared it in a haul and I will link that haul for you guys because I got a lot of good stuff for fall. And so I decided while I was in Hobby Lobby to get two more because I really love these. They were really pretty in the design that I got. And I insert a picture of the arrangement that I made with these picks. And the next pick is this one here. I saw someone feature it in their video and I just thought it was nice. Um, it's really full. With picks like this, I you can use them just as they come or you can take them apart and use them for fillers and other um, decor designs that you're doing. I really like picks like this because they are very versatile when it comes to decorating. And this one was $4.99, a lot of detail. Like I said, you could just leave it as it is or take it apart and use it for fillers for other designs. So the next picks are these here. And these were $2.99. And I got two of these. And then I got this one here. And this one was $3.99. Sometimes um, I don't always get a bunch of one thing unless I really, really like it. You'll see me get maybe like one or two like how I'm doing here. And I do that because I'm not sure if I really um, like the pick or if I need a lot. Sometimes I just get one pick because I'm using it as you know a filler for something else. So I only got one of these. And then I got some more of the pumpkin picks and they were $3.99. So I got this kind of like mustard yellow, really pretty. Then I got two of the like reddish orange color. I just love the detail of these picks. So pretty. And like I said, I am using neutral colors in my fall design, but I will be doing a fall um, tree and my tree will have the traditional colors. Then I picked up this little sign here. I just thought it was so cute and it was $3.99, $3.99. And you can use something like this on a tear tray or in your coffee station decor. So the next item is this charcuterie board. Remember in my last video, I told you guys that I was going to pick up another one, for, one for me and one for my hubby. So I picked that up and I just think these charcuterie boards, miniature charcuterie boards are so nice guys. And you know, you can, you can use them for regular boards. Like I have some cutting boards and so you can use it to decorate with your cutting board also. And the very last item are these utensils. I got these utensils here. 
I got the spoon. Oh, this is the whisk. I have a skimmer. And then the spoon. And then the turner. So I got these to go in my utensil holder. I love the wooden detail of it. Well, the full wood detail of it. And the black. Just thought that was really nice. So I got these. And that is about it, guys. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, comment, share. But most of all, subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. And oh yeah, guys, when you hit that subscribe button, hit the notification button so you won't miss any of my uploads. Bye, guys.